quick video to show you how to tighten the chain on your chainsaw. You can see on this one, the chain's very loose and it could even jump off the bar here, um, as loose as it is. So all chainsaws have basically the same two controls to manage the tension of the chain. And it all has to do with the bar. Right up front, there'll be some type of friction uh, release for the bar. It'll either be a couple screws, uh, bolts. In this case, it's like a pressure wheel that reduces tension on the bar itself because where the bar is positioned forward or back is how tight the chain's gonna be. So what you're gonna wanna do first is reduce that friction or loosen those bolts. Then you've got a control um, as well. Sometimes it's located at the front here. It's just gonna be some type of screw. In this case, it's got a handle. So as I screw it clockwise towards the plus side, it's gonna pull the chain in tighter. And as I go counterclockwise towards the negative side, I get more looseness here on the chain. So you're going to want to adjust this uh, the position of the bar uh, to where you where you find the tension is is ideal for your situation. In my case, I like to be able to pull it off just off the bar, but but not too much that the that the bottom of the chain uh, could hop out. So here feels a little bit too loose, but this is where I'm liking it right about in here. Feels like it's in a controlled uh, uh, set in that groove. Now, if you put your chain too tight, that's a bad thing as well because you're going to wear out your bar, especially right up in here where there's so much tension on the chain because it's being pulled back um, by the way it's it's rigged in here. So you're not going to want to do it too tight. You're going to want to let it have a little bit of play so that, play, that chain can glide across that bar with plenty of oil uh, as you're cutting. So when you got it right where you want it to be, you're going to go ahead and tighten that friction back down. That'll squeeze the bar into place here and the bar won't move and then the chain should hold the position that you set it at. And if it didn't, you're gonna to wanna to check, you're gonna go back and then readjust it again, okay? So that's it, that's how you adjust the tension on your chainsaw blade. Uh, if this was helpful to you, please give the video a thumbs up. That'll help other people find it as well. Uh, and always, as always, have a great day.